Hey, what's up guys? It's Danny Milan. Thank you for clicking on this video. Today I'm going to show you how to play a D major 7. Boom! I'm going to show you five different ways to play it. Literally show you, then I'll teach you how to play it. One. Let me teach you how to play those five different ways of playing a D major seven. Your in the first one is the easiest. Your index finger, well, the fourth one and the first one are the easiest. Your index finger is going to be barring the G, the D, or the G, the B, and the E strings on the second fret. And the only strings that are going to be played are the D, G, B, and E. So with your thumb, you can mute these top two strings. You can even strum. These are not going to ring out. If they did, it would sound weird. It would sound like this. Alright. Next one, right here. Your index finger is going to be barring the entire 5th fret from the A string down. Then your middle finger is going to be on the G string 6th fret. Your ring finger is going to be on the D string 7th fret. And your pinky is going to be on the B string 7th fret. Simple enough. Let's go to the next one. Your index finger is going to be barring the D, G, and B strings on the 7th fret, and your pinky is going to be right here on the 9th fret of the high E. And those four strings are the only ones that are being played. Next one, your index finger is going to be here on the 10th fret of the low E. Your middle finger is going to be on the 10th fret of the B. Your ring finger is going to be on the 11th fret of the D, and your pinky is going to be on the 11th fret of the G. And you're going to be playing the B, D, G, and B. Wait, did I say that right? E, D, G, and B. Alright, so you're going to be plucking those. Or strum it, strum it. If you can mute this one and this one, just strum it. Otherwise, just pluck it. Alright, and the last one is right here. Your index finger is going to be... Let me... Hold on, let me get it right. Okay, yeah, yeah, that's how you play it. Alright, so your index finger is going to be on the D... Or not on the D, on the G of the 11th fret. Your ring finger... Or your middle finger is going to be on the A of the 12th fret. And your pinky is going to be on the B of the 14th fret. And you're going to play the A, the D, the G, and the B strings. Alright. If Also, if you want to just like put your... If you want to put your middle finger right there, like on the 12th fret of the D, you can do that also. Because that's also a D, D, D uh, note, the 12th, because that's an octave. It's the same exact note, but it's just easier to do it like this. Because the re the, you still hear the D. But anyways, guys, thank you for watching that video. Remember to comment, like, subscribe, and see you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching. Peace.